Hello good people! We have another exciting tutorial for you guys today as always and in today's tutorial I'm going to show you guys how to change the icons on your iPhone, iPod Touch, or iPad without jailbreaking. And to do this you're only going to need one app which you can download from the App Store. It costs 99 cents and there'll be a link to it in the description below and it's called Iconical. And I'm going to show you guys its interface right now and how it works. Let's go ahead and open it up. It has a very nice user interface. Once the app is open you want to start off by selecting the app you want to change. Um, I'm just going to have system apps listed because I don't have any additional apps installed, but if you did, they would show up here in a list. And let's say I want to change um, the Safari icon. So I'm going to click Create. And then from here, I can kind of edit this picture as is. So I could you know, press on the pencil tool, select a color, select a pink, and just kind of draw on it. Save that. Or if I wanted to, I could take a picture. So let's just take a photo and let's capture something. Beautiful. And then from here, if I wanted to, I could resize it. I could probably stitch two pictures together. But once I have uh, what I want to be my icon, I can click use. And then again from there, I can doodle a little bit, change my color. change my opacity and I can also change the brush size so let's say I wanted a nice big pink dot Boom. beautiful beautiful Safari app if I do say so myself uh, and then we can title the icon and let's say we want to call it uh, Safi I don't know why you would want to call it that but let's say you do um, then you can go on to create a home icon and then you just want to save it to your home screen. So what this is essentially doing, it's not really changing the uh, original default icon. What it's really doing is creating almost a web app that links to the actual application. So if I clicked on Safi, it would then open up Safari and then I could do my browsing as I pleased. So that's Iconical. Another option that the app has is that you can actually download images from a URL. So let's say you really wanted to theme your icons as opposed to just creating your own. You could enter in a URL and it'll download the image attached to that URL as the icon and then you can add from there or just use it as is. But that's going to be the video I have for you guys today. If you enjoyed it, make sure to give the video a like, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Feel free to follow me on Twitter at Fisher12. A link down in the description as well to that. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and take care.